Hi everyone, welcome to and back to my channel. Today I want to talk about my Louis Vuitton Torch Pouch 15 and my Louis Vuitton Mini Pochette. And I want to show you what fits inside both of these items, size comparison, and how I use it. And also, in case you're curious about what in this item, which item you think will fit best with your lifestyle, which one you want in your collection, or maybe you want both of your collection and you're trying to decide if they're both worth it. So let's get started. I already have a video on what fits inside on my mini pochette, so if you want to watch that, please go check it out. So I'm going to start with the Toiletry Pouch 15. So the canvas is monogram, and it's all around. So you have the front, the bottom, the back, and then you have the side. I love how they put the LV logo on the side. I think that was a nice touch. And it says Louis Vuitton. Paris made in Spain. And I keep my items stuffed. I keep it stuffed to help with the stretcher. And so it can stand on its own. When I first bought it, it was not standing. So I decided to um, stuff my items. And now it's standing on its own. Um, also when it comes to the measurements, I don't have it right now. But I will link it down below. Hopefully you guys can hear me. They're doing construction outside, so if you hear heavy noise, that's why. So I apologize. So inside, we have the beige interior. So if you guys can see. Oh, okay. You have the beige interior. And the type of um, material inside is lining. So if you happen to um, spill something inside, it should be able to wipe. So that's one good thing one good thing about it so I guess that's one of the pros for this item another pro I would say is the way that they structure it so when it comes to what fits more it's this one because of how it's structured you have that extra room on this side right here that gives you more of a room so let's start with what I can put inside so first I have my Chanel card holder and just to show you in comparison, so I put that inside. And here you go. So you can see the room you have left. And then I have my Saint Laurent lipstick. You can let's see. There you go. You can try to do it standing up. Let's see how that will work. Okay. Uh, next, I have hand sanitizer, which is important right now. And see, I put it right there. Um, what else? I have perfume samples. These are Louis Vuitton. I have keys, car keys. And let's see, can I put So this is what it looks like right now. Oh, I forgot to bring my headphones. So let's see if we can close it right now. How it close. So, so it's pretty much Disordered right now. I think it's because of the way I placed the card holder. So let me try to rearrange it. Okay, so plus my keys are pretty thick as well. Oh, plus I have the hand sanitizer. So okay, so now it's like that. The keys are on top. So I'm gonna try to close it. see if it closing okay there you go so now it fits better it's not so disordered and it's closed up, up all the way and the shape is good and it's not bulging out too much so let's see what else we can do so let's take this out 
So instead of the card holder, and we still have the lipstick and the uh, perfume sample. Let's say we have <clears throat> my key pouch class, which is also from Louis Vuitton. Put that in there. So you see right here. And then we have a lip balm. Let's try, we're gonna do another hand sanitizer. And let's see, this is another lipstick. Let's see if that was the up. Yeah, and it's not because. But once again, you guys, the main reason is because of the hand sanitizer, and I just wanna include that because you know what's going on right now. My hand sanitizer is pretty big, but like I said, if you have a, a smaller version, then of course you'll fit way more. So let's say we're not doing a hand sanitizer. We just have our key pouch class, the mini perfume samples, the lip balm, the lipstick, um, another perfume, not fit, yes. Say we try some sunglasses, cannot fit. Oh, can it fit? No, I don't think so. Wait, let me try one more time. See, it's angled out, so the sunglasses can't fit. That's what I think of. And then let's try the car keys again. Okay, flip it up. Okay, and there we go. So that fits. So what we have is the key pouch cleanse, we have the lipstick, two perfume samples, um, what else did I put inside? My car keys, and another perfume sample. Oh, and a lip balm as well. And it's a little bit heavy, but it's not dramatic heavy. Whereas I know I can still carry this on my own or put this inside of my bags. So we had the car keys, perfume, lip balm, key pouch clays, another lipstick, and the two perfume samples. Now I want to try to do the sunglasses again to see if it will fit on its own. So. It kind of does, but it's at an angle. But I'll be scared to scratch the interior, so I don't know if I would do that. So let's say you want to use this just as a toy tree. Or like a mini makeup bag. So you have your lipstick. And this is Saint Laurent, by the way, in case you're curious. Number, this one is number... 23. There you go. You have a perfume. Lip balm. Perfume samples. So you still want to do the hand sanitizer. Fits in there nice. And then you can probably still do car keys. Zip it up. Still a little bit disordered, like right here and right here. So let's take off the car keys. Keep the hand sanitizer. And there you go. And it fits really well. I also forgot to bring some cards and uh, my headphones. But we pretend, just pretend that the cards are the actual card hoarder and they're inside. And that's what fits inside for this one. So now we're gonna try, take everything out. Okay, and now we're gonna try the mini pochette. 
So here's a mini machete. I have it in the Damier Bandy Canvas. Okay, the checker print. And it says the logo's right here. My favorite thing about this is how you can take off this chain right here. Let's see. Okay. Attach it to this D ring. And then you have, you can wear it as a wrist. And that's one thing that I really love of what Louis Vuitton did. And I can tell why this is one of those items that everyone really looking for. And it's always sold out online. Because this right here, able to carry it hands-free. Whereas the Toiletry Pod 15, you have to carry it in your hand. is a game changer. So that's one thing that this definitely has over the 15. Is that you can use it as a wristlet or carry it as a mini purse. So that's, if that's something that bothers you, if you want to know how to carry it, if you want to be hands-free, then for sure, the mini pochette. You're going to pick the mini pochette over the Torture Pouch 15. And this also comes in the dam and the monogram, which is this canvas right here, in case you don't like the Damier bin. So I'm going to open it up. Like I said, I keep adding stuff to keep it stretcher. Sorry, I've had a few items in here already. And then another great thing about the Dimeer Ben, you have the beautiful red interior. Hope you can see that really well. Um, the monogram the will not come with the red interior. It will just come with a dark brown one. So that's one pro that I like about this. I love the red interior. It's just a pop of color and you can see your items very well. So now I'm going to show you what I can fit inside. So let's say I have, what's again, my card holder from Chanel. And that fits right that. Um, let's say I want to do a pen. few perfume samples a lipstick and then you still have room here on this side too so say so you want to do a panty liner so I put that in the front right there a lip balm I put that right there so let's see how it is this one is like popping up when you close it. See? But I think it's still going close. Unless you put it in the, let's see if we put it in the back. All right, there you go. So we put that in the back. What else? Um, let's see if we can fit the key pouch clips inside. Can we? Yep, it looks like it's in there. So I'm gonna try to close it for you guys. Oh, and it fit. Wow. So we have two of my card holders, two, a lipstick, a lip balm, perfume samples, and a pen, and a panty liner. And the shape still looks really good. I'm really impressed. You know, they say the Torchy Pouch 15 fits more, but I don't know, sometimes I think the mini pochette actually fits more. I even put my cell phone inside and my sunglasses inside. But I don't know, maybe I was wrong. All right, let's try more. Let's take out some of the items. Oh, and in case you're curious about my card holder, I did do um, an unboxing of it on my channel, so please go check it out. So here I have it empty. So we have, let's say we want car keys. Let's say we want to do hand sanitizer, pretend we're doing like a quick grocery run. We want to do a pen, because we want to use our own pen, not a, someone else's, so we are being safe. So that's in here. Um, penny liner, always keep that in case you need it. A lip balm.
And let's see if we can do some sunglasses. Can it fit? Well, I got it to fit last time, but I think it was just the way I put it. Yeah, just the side of it's not fitting. And let's say we want to do a key pouch. Put that somewhere. No, it's not going to fit. But so let's. There you go. So inside, I just have the car keys, the hand sanitizer, panty liner, a lip balm, and I think I did a perfume sample. So this is just perfect for on the go. If you want to go grocery shopping, you got to go do a quick errand. Everything that you need is in here. And of course, I think also think like a mask should definitely fit inside. Plastic gloves should fit inside. I stuff um, gloves and a mask inside over the weekend and that also fits as well. So you can see. So I'm gonna do one more. So let's say you want to do a date night, which probably is gonna be a long time before we do that, but hey. So I will probably bring this card holder with me. That's in. I'll probably bring a lipstick. Let's see if I can. I think it's better if I put it down. Maybe I'll bring two lipstick. So we have two. I'll definitely try to bring um, a panty liner. And I'm going to put the panty liner in the front. Um, let's say I want to do some perfume samples, and I put the perfume samples on the front. And let's say I want to bring, so let's say, so this is a perfume sample, but let's say this is um, eyeliner. So we'll pretend that's eyeliner, see if we can fit it inside. Yeah, I kind of went inside, just slant it a bit. And let's zip it up. And there you go. Let's see, it's a little disorientated with the front though. Let's see. It's not too bad, but it's not horrible. So we had my Chanel card case, two lipsticks, uh, perfume, which we would say is eyeliner, perfume samples, and panty liner and if I'm going out I probably won't bring my keys because someone else is driving which would be my boyfriend and I'll just keep my garage opener in his car in case that can be an option things out and there you go you guys so I'm trying to figure out anything else I can put like I said, I'm sorry I forgot my headphones and I forgot to bring my cards. So here we have it. So we have the mini pochette and the torture pouch 15. Overall, which one is my favorite? I would have to say is the mini pochette. I love it. Like I said, the fact that I can put this on my wrist and use it as a catch up, that's a really, really big yes for me. And I'm hands-free. I love to be hands-free. That's why most of my bags are crossbody. Um, I love the red interior. It's so small, but I honestly can tell you guys I actually fit my phone inside there once, and it was an iPhone 6 and sunglasses. It's definitely an item that you can just stuff inside, and you're on the go. And because of the canvas is that mirror bin, I can I don't have to be um, baby it. I can literally throw it around, but I'm not technically going to do that but just an example however the reason why i also like torture pouch 15 i love the shape of it i love the monogram i still think it's just a cat shell you should have in your collection in case you go travel or you know let's say this is full and you still have more items that you need to um put then you have this as a backup so that's another reason how i look at it and why i have this on my collection or you know sometimes i want to take this with me and carrying it around like I said I don't mind using it as a carrier but of course when it comes to being hands-free that is number one for me as well and 
even though in all these show that this definitely fit more there are going to be some items where this fits perfectly in there my um, car hold was definitely longer so if i think if i had maybe shorter i think the gucci card hold card holder is shorter or smaller and the saint laurent definitely fits inside both of these as well key pouch definitely fits inside and what makes um more room is let's say i don't use any of the card holders i just place my cards inside place the cards inside my lippies um all the other products that i need and that works out as well so i really hope that i help you guys figure out what fits inside your first impressions and you know if you're just still deciding on which item you like um i like both of them i still don't see myself selling the 15 um because i feel like i would regret it especially both of the items are sold out both of the items have price increase and i know they're going to continue um uh, making sure the price goes up and then people who sell this over retail price so I am rather my rather just keep it I wouldn't buy it from somewhere um, I know this before was 355 and now it's around 410 415 and this was 365 and now it's no no this was 310 and now it's 365 and I see people sell this for four to six hundred dollars. Same with this, five to six hundred dollars. So I think I'm gonna keep it because I know I'm definitely gonna regret it, and I'm not gonna pay twice or three times as much as the retail. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for walk watching. I hope I helped you, and have a great day. Bye.